Can we make Venus habitable? If we remove its crushing atmosphere, could this hell-like planet finally become a place where life can survive? Venus has an atmosphere 90 times thicker than the atmosphere of Earth, made almost entirely of carbon dioxide, covered by clouds of sulfuric acid, and heated by a runaway greenhouse effect strong enough to melt lead. But this massive atmosphere also works like a protective shield against the sun, so we reduce it to the level of Earth. At first, it looks promising. The temperature drops, the surface cools, and the Earth's similarity score rises quickly. But when we fast forward the simulation, everything collapses. The temperature falls to minus 60 degrees Celsius, and Venus slowly begins to lose the rest of its atmosphere. Here is the main problem. Venus has almost no magnetic field. Its thick carbon dioxide atmosphere normally protects it, but once that layer is removed, the planet becomes exposed. The solar wind begins stripping the atmosphere away, molecule by molecule, into space. The final result is clear. Reducing the atmosphere of Venus does not make it habitable. It destroys it. With a weak magnetic field and a thin atmosphere, Venus cannot hold on to its air. It freezes, its sky disappears, and life never has a chance to exist.